Chapter 1. The Olfactory Voyage Begins. Perfumery, a captivating dance of aromatic notes and olfactory harmonies, is an ancient art form that transcends time, weaving together the threads of artistry, history, and cultural significance. The enchanting world of perfumery is a testament to humanity's quest to capture and express the ineffable through the language of scent leaving an indelible mark on the tapestry of our collective experiences, the artistry of perfumery. Crafting olfactory masterpieces, at its core, perfumery is a form of sensory artistry, where skilled perfumers blend various aromatic ingredients to create olfactory masterpieces that resonate with the human soul. The palette of a perfumer is vast and diverse, ranging from delicate floral notes to rich, earthy accords, each carefully chosen to evoke specific emotions and memories. The process of creating a perfume is akin to composing a symphony. Perfumers meticulously layer individual notes stop, middle, and base to achieve a harmonious blend that unfolds over time. The artistry lies not only in selecting and balancing these notes, but also in understanding how they will interact with the wearer's skin and environment. Fragrance houses often have master perfumers, individuals with an extraordinary olfactory acuity and a deep understanding of the artistic nuances of perfumery. These artists draw inspiration from a myriad of sources, including nature, literature, and personal experiences, infusing their creations with a distinct signature that sets them apart. The artistry of perfumery extends beyond the fragrance itself to the design of the bottle and the packaging. Perfume bottles become vessels of aesthetic expression, their shapes and designs reflecting the essence of the scent within. The entire presentation, from the color of the perfume to the typography on the label, is carefully curated to enhance the overall sensory experience. The History of Perfumery A Journey Through Time and Cultures The history of perfumery is a rich tapestry woven with threads that trace back to ancient civilizations where aromatic rituals held spiritual, medicinal, and cultural significance. The art of perfumery can be glimpsed in the corridors of time, resonating through the annals of diverse cultures, ancient civilizations, Mesopotamia, Egypt, and beyond. The roots of perfumery can be traced to ancient Mesopotamia, where the earliest recorded recipes for fragrance date back to around 2000 BC. In Egypt, the use of fragrances was intertwined with religious ceremonies, funerary practices, and daily life. The ancient Egyptians created complex blends using ingredients like myrrh, frankincense, and various resins, laying the foundation for perfumery as a refined art. In India, the Ayurvedic tradition incorporated the use of fragrant oils for both medicinal and spiritual purposes. The art of perfumery found its way along the Silk Road, spreading to Greece and Rome. In these civilizations, Perfumes were associated with luxury, status, and hedonistic pursuits. The Islamic Golden Age, a perfumed renaissance. During the Islamic Golden Age, 8th to 14th centuries, the art of perfumery reached new heights. Islamic scholars translated and preserved the knowledge of ancient perfumers, contributing to the development of intricate distillation techniques. The renowned Persian polymath Sina, known in the West as Avicenna, wrote extensively on perfumery, emphasizing the importance of precision in distillation. In Islamic culture, perfumery became an integral part of daily life, with the development of intricate perfume bottles and the establishment of perfumers' guilds. Distillation methods refined during this era laid the groundwork for modern perfumery techniques. The Renaissance, perfume in the courts of Europe. As Europe emerged from the Dark Ages, Perfume experienced renaissance of its own. The courts of Renaissance Europe became centers of perfumed indulgence, with royalty and nobility using fragrances to mask unpleasant odors and signify social status. Italian and French perfumers gained acclaim for their skillful blending of exotic ingredients, further elevating perfumery to an art form. The Renaissance also saw the establishment of grass in the south of France as a prominent centre for the production of raw materials for perfumery. Grass's climate and soil were ideal for cultivating flowers like jasmine and rose, essential ingredients in many classic perfumes. The Industrial Revolution 
mass production and accessibility. The Industrial Revolution in the 19th century marked a significant shift in the world of perfumery. Advances in chemistry allowed for the synthesis of aromatic compounds, enabling the mass production of perfumes. This era witnessed the creation of iconic fragrances like Chanel No. 5 which utilized synthetic aldehydes to achieve a modern and groundbreaking scent. Perfumery, once a luxury reserved for the elite, became more accessible to the masses. The democratization of fragrance allowed individuals from various social strata to enjoy the artistry of perfumery, expanding its cultural impact. The 20th century Innovation and cultural influences The 20th century brought about a wave of innovation and cultural influences that shaped the landscape of perfumery. The Art Deco movement influenced the design of perfume bottles, turning them into objects d'art. Hollywood glamour and celebrity culture further heightened the association between perfume and personal identity. The mid-20th century saw the emergence of niche and designer fragrances, offering alternatives to the mass-market appeal of certain perfumes. Designers like Christian Dior and Coco Chanel became synonymous with signature scents that embodied their fashion aesthetics. Contemporary perfumery, a fusion of tradition and innovation. In the 21st century, perfumery continues to evolve, embracing both the traditions of the past and the innovations of the present. Niche perfumers and independent houses push the boundaries of olfactory creativity crafting unique and unconventional scents that cater to individualistic tastes. The rise of sustainability and ethical practices has also become a significant aspect of contemporary perfumery. Perfume houses are increasingly mindful of sourcing practices, opting for sustainable and responsibly harvested raw materials. Additionally, there is a growing awareness of the environmental impact of fragrance production, leading to initiatives for eco-friendly packaging and reduced carbon footprints. Cultural significance of perfumery. A universal language of expression, beyond its artistic and historical dimensions, perfumery holds profound cultural significance as a universal language of expression. Fragrance transcends linguistic barriers, allowing individuals to communicate and connect through the shared experience of scent. Ceremonial and spiritual significance throughout history, Various cultures have incorporated fragrances into ceremonial and spiritual practices, from the burning of incense in religious rituals to the anointing of the body with scented oils. Fragrances have played a role in transcendent experiences and spiritual connections. Cultural identity and personal expression. Perfumery is a powerful tool for expressing cultural identity and personal style. Different regions have distinct aromatic traditions and individuals often choose scents that resonate with their cultural background or convey a desired image. The choice of perfume becomes a form of self-expression, reflecting personality, mood, and aspirations. Social rituals and traditions. Perfumery is deeply woven into the fabric of social rituals and traditions. The exchange of perfumed gifts, the application of fragrance before social events, and the use of scents to mark significant life moments are common practices across cultures. Fragrance becomes a symbol of celebration, connection, and chapter two, the perfumer's palette. The foundation of perfumery lies in a diverse and exquisite palette of aromatic materials, each contributing to the symphony of scents that defines fragrances. These materials, carefully selected and artfully blended by perfumers, encompass a wide range of natural and synthetic compounds, creating a rich and nuanced olfactory landscape. From the floral elegance of essential oils to the complex chemistry of synthetic molecules, the aromatic materials in perfumery are the building blocks of olfactory artistry. 1. Essential oils. The essence of nature. Essential oils are the aromatic essence extracted from various parts of plants, including flowers, leaves, stems, and fruits. These natural oils are the soul of perfumery, embodying the scents of the botanical world. The extraction methods, such as steam distillation, cold pressing, or solvent extraction, vary based on the plant material. Floral essences, blossoms in a bottle. Floral essential oils are the epitome of elegance in perfumery. Extracted from the blossoms of flowers, they capture the essence of nature's most exquisite creations. Rose, 
jasmine, lavender, and neroli are among the cherished floral essences that lend their delicate and often intoxicating aromas to perfumes. The process of obtaining floral essences is meticulous, requiring large volumes of flowers to yield small quantities of precious oil, making these ingredients highly sought after. Citrus oils, zesty and invigorating, derived from the peels of citrus fruits, Citrus essential oils add a burst of freshness and vibrancy to perfumes. Bergamot, orange, lemon, and grapefruit oils are popular choices, bringing a zesty and invigorating quality to fragrances. Citrus oils are often used as top notes, contributing to the initial impression of a perfume and providing a bright and uplifting character. Herbaceous and green oils, a breath of fresh air, Essential oils extracted from herbs and green plant parts offer a verdant and herbaceous dimension to perfumery. Ingredients like basil, mint and parsley provide a breath of fresh air, infusing fragrances with a green and aromatic quality. These oils can evoke the crispness of a garden after rainfall or the aromatic charm of a herbal bouquet. Woody essences, earthy and timeless, the roots, Box and woods of trees contribute woody essences that form the backbone of many perfumes. Sandalwood, cedarwood, and vetiver impart an earthy and timeless quality to fragrances. These oils often serve as middle and base notes, adding depth, warmth, and a sense of grounding to the overall composition. Resinous notes. Precious extracts, resinous materials, often derived from the sap or resin of trees, provide perfumery with precious and luxurious notes. Frankincense, myrrh, and benzoin are examples of resins that bring a rich and balsamic character to fragrances. These materials have been valued throughout history for their association with spiritual rituals and their opulent, lingering scents. 2. Absolute Extracts Concentrated elegance. Absolute extracts are highly concentrated aromatic materials obtained through solvent extraction. This method captures a broader spectrum of aromatic compounds, resulting in a richer and more complex fragrance profile compared to essential oils. Floral absolutes. Intense and luscious, floral absolutes offer an intensified version of the blossoms from which they are derived, with a higher concentration of aromatic compounds. These extracts provide a more intense and luscious representation of the flower scent. Rose Absolute, Jasmine Absolute and Tuberose Absolute are coveted ingredients in perfumery, prized for their depth and opulence. Concrete and Resinoids Capturing the essence, concrete and resinoids are semi-solid aromatic materials obtained through solvent extraction. They are often derived from flowers, resins or other botanical sources, capturing the true essence of the plant in a concentrated form. 3. Distillates and waters. Subtle elegance. Hydrosols, also known as distillates or floral waters, are co-products of the steam distillation process used to extract essential oils. These aromatic waters possess a subtle elegance and capture the more delicate facets of a plant's aroma. Rose water, lavender water, and orange blossom water are common hydrosols used in perfumery, adding a gentle and refreshing touch to fragrances. 4. Synthetic molecules. Innovation and precision. In addition to natural extracts, synthetic molecules play a crucial role in modern perfumery, offering perfumers an expansive palette of possibilities and enabling the creation of novel scents. Synthetic molecules are meticulously designed in laboratories, allowing for precision in fragrance composition and the recreation of scents that may be challenging or unsustainable to extract from natural sources. Aldehydes, sparkling and modern. Aldehydes are a class of synthetic compounds that impart a sparkling and modern quality to perfumes. Their introduction revolutionized perfumery, most notably in iconic fragrances like Chanel No. 5. Aldehydes contribute a clean, soapy or effervescent character elevating the overall freshness of a scent. Aroma chemicals. Versatility and replication. Aroma chemicals are synthetic compounds designed to replicate or enhance specific scent characteristics. They provide perfumers with a level of versatility and control, allowing for the precise recreation of natural scents or the invention of entirely new olfactory experiences. Isoe Super. Hedione and Ambroxan are examples of aroma chemicals widely used in perfumery. Olfactory Harmony 
blending the palette. The artistry of perfumery lies in the skillful blending of these diverse aromatic materials to create a harmonious composition. Perfumers carefully select ingredients based on their volatility, longevity, and olfactory characteristics, considering how each note will unfold over time on the skin. Top Notes The initial impression Top notes are the first olfactory impressions of a perfume, providing the initial burst of scent. Often composed of citrus oils, herbal notes, or light florals, top notes are volatile and evaporate quickly, creating the first and most fleeting impression of a fragrance. Middle notes. The heart of the fragrance, middle notes, also known as heart notes, form the core of a fragrance. These notes emerge once the top notes have dissipated, revealing the true character and theme of the perfume. Floral absolutes, herbaceous elements, and spicy accords often contribute to the middle notes, providing a bridge between the initial freshness and the lingering base notes. Base notes. The enduring essence, base notes are the foundation of a fragrance, providing depth and longevity. Woody essences, resins, and rich, balsamic notes form the base lingering on the skin long after the top and middle notes have faded. Base notes anchor the fragrance, leaving a lasting impression and creating a sense of olfactory memory. Conclusion A perfume symphony In the world of perfumery, the aromatic materials form a symphony of scents, each note contributing to a composition that is both an artful creation and a cultural expression. From the timeless allure of natural extracts to the precision of synthetic molecules, Perfumers draw from a vast palette to craft olfactory masterpieces that evoke emotions, memories, and sensory delight. The aromatic materials in perfumery not only capture the essence of nature, but also propel the art forward into new realms of the art of perfumery is an olfactory symphony, a harmonious composition that unfolds on the skin like a melody of notes, each contributing to a fragrant masterpiece. Perfumers, akin to skilled composers, draw inspiration from a diverse and nuanced palette of raw ingredients, weaving together scents that evoke emotions, tell stories, and resonate with the essence of nature. This olfactory symphony, conducted by the hands of perfumers, celebrates the marriage of creativity and craftsmanship in the world of fragrance. 1. The Prelude Top notes dancing in the air The olfactory symphony begins with the bright and effervescent top notes, dancing in the air like the opening strains of a musical prelude. Citrus oils, such as bergamot, lemon and orange, introduce a burst of freshness and vitality. These notes are often complemented by herbaceous elements like basil or the crispness of aldehydes, creating an invigorating and lively overture to the fragrance. The top notes, though fleeting, set the stage for the olfactory journey, offering the first impression that lingers in the air. Like the high notes in a musical piece, they add sparkle and vibrancy, inviting the senses to embark on a sensory adventure. 2. The Crescendo Floral and fruity heart notes As the symphony progresses, the heart notes take center stage, creating a crescendo of floral and fruity harmonies. These notes, often derived from the petals of flowers or the essence of fruits, add depth and complexity to the composition. Rose Jasmine and Ilang Ilang contribute their floral richness, while fruits like apple, peach, or berries infuse a sweet and vibrant melody. The heart notes form the emotional core of the fragrance, much like the emotional peak in a musical composition. They unfold gracefully on the skin, revealing layers of scent that interweave and evolve, creating a sensory tapestry that captures the essence of blooming flowers and ripe fruits. 3. The Bass Line Woody and earthy undertones. As the olfactory symphony progresses, the bass line emerges, grounding the composition with woody and earthy undertones. Woods such as sandalwood, cedarwood, and vetiver provide a sturdy foundation, adding warmth and sensuality. Earthy elements, like patchouli or moss, contribute a touch of the terrestrial, creating a connection to nature's embrace. Much like the bass line in music, these notes provide depth and resonance anchoring the fragrance and extending its longevity. The earthy undertones lend a timeless quality, evoking the feeling of walking through a forest or basking in the warmth of the earth beneath the summer sun. 4. The Finale Resinous and balsamic bass notes The olfactory symphony reaches its crescendo in the bass notes, 
a grand finale of resinous and balsamic richness. Ingredients like frankincense, myrrh, and benzoin impart a luxurious and lingering quality, akin to the lingering notes in the final moments of a musical masterpiece. The bass notes create a lasting impression, leaving an olfactory memory that lingers on the skin, much like the lingering resonance of a final chord. These bass notes not only add opulence to the fragrance, but also offer a sense of closure, completing the olfactory narrative. Like the concluding moments of a symphony, the bass notes leave a lingering echo, inviting the wearer to savour the lingering afterglow of the fragrance. 5. The Art of Blending Crafting harmonious compositions, the magic of the olfactory symphony lies in the perfumer's artful blending of these raw ingredients. Much like a composer selecting instruments for a symphony, perfumers choose each note with precision, considering its volatility, longevity, and olfactory characteristics. The challenge is to create a harmonious composition, where each note contributes to the overall balance, enhancing the beauty of the fragrance as a whole. Blending is both a science and an art in perfumery. The perfumer must consider not only the olfactory qualities of each ingredient, but also how they interact with one another over time. The evolving nature of a fragrance, from the initial burst of top notes to the lingering resonance of bass notes, requires a keen understanding of the raw material's nuances. 6. The Virtuosity of Natural Ingredients a symphony of complexity, natural ingredients, with their inherent complexity and nuance, bring a sense of virtuosity to the olfactory symphony. Essential oils, absolutes, and extracts derived from botanical sources carry the subtle variations and intricacies that nature provides. Each harvest, influenced by climate, soil, and cultivation practices, introduces unique characteristics making natural ingredients a symphony of ever-changing complexity. The diversity of natural ingredients allows perfumers to create fragrances that capture the richness of the natural world. From the rare and precious notes of oud to the delicate floral nuances of iris, these natural raw materials contribute to the symphonic richness of perfumery. 7. The Innovation of Synthetic Notes Expanding the orchestra, in addition to natural ingredients, Perfumers leverage the innovation of synthetic molecules to expand the olfactory orchestra. These molecules, meticulously designed in laboratories, offer a level of precision and control that allows perfumers to craft scents beyond the limitations of nature. Aldehydes, for example, bring a modern and sparkling quality to fragrances, while aromachemicals like ISOE Super add depth and longevity. Synthetic notes enable perfumers to push the boundaries of olfactory creativity, creating compositions that may be challenging or impossible to achieve with natural ingredients alone. They enhance the symphony, adding unique timbres and textures to the fragrance. 8. Personal Symphony the Olfactory Identity Ultimately, the Olfactory Symphony is a deeply personal experience with each wearer becoming the conductor of their own fragrance journey. The symphony of raw ingredients becomes a part of an individual's olfactory identity, shaping their sensory landscape and evoking personal memories and emotions. As individuals explore the world of perfumery, discovering fragrances that resonate with their preferences, they curate their own symphony of scents. Each perfume becomes a note in their olfactory composition, contributing to the harmonious melody that accompanies them through life. Conclusion Olfactory poetry unfolding In the grand theatre of perfumery, the Olfactory Symphony is a testament to the artistry, creativity, and craftsmanship of perfumers. The carefully curated raw ingredients, from the lively top notes to the lingering bass notes, come together to create olfactory poetry that unfolds on the skin. The Symphony of Scents celebrates the beauty of nature, the innovation of science, and the intimate connection between fragrance and personal expression. As wearers embark on their fragrant journey, they become part of a timeless symphony, a sensory masterpiece that resonates with the essence of life's olfactory poetry. The craftsmanship of scent creation is a delicate and intricate art form, where perfumers, like master artisans, skillfully blend raw ingredients to craft olfactory masterpieces. This alchemical process requires a deep understanding of fragrance materials, a keen sense of creativity, and the ability to weave together harmonious compositions that evoke emotions, 
tell stories, and leave a lasting impression. The craftsmanship of scent creation is a dance of the senses, a symphony of aromas that enfolds on the skin and resonates with the human spirit. The perfumer's palette. A symphony of raw materials at the heart of scent creation is the perfumer's palette, a diverse and nuanced collection of raw materials that range from natural essences to synthetic molecules. Essential oils extracted from flowers, fruits and woods provide the soul of a fragrance, offering a connection to nature's aromatic wonders. Absolutes and resins bring depth and richness, while synthetic molecules enable perfumers to push the boundaries of creativity and innovation. The craftsmanship lies in the perfumer's ability to navigate this vast palette, selecting and combining ingredients with precision. Each material has its own olfactory characteristics, volatility, and longevity, and the perfumer must orchestrate them like a conductor leading a symphony. It is in the artful blending of these diverse elements that the magic of scent creation unfolds, understanding olfactory architecture. Top, middle, and base notes, crafting a fragrance is akin to building a three-dimensional olfactory structure, with distinct layers that unfold over time. The top notes are the first impressions, the initial burst of scent that captivates the senses. These are often bright, fresh, and volatile, creating an enticing opening to the fragrance. Citrus oils, herbal notes, and aldehydes frequently play a role in the top notes. The middle notes, also known as heart notes, form the emotional core of the fragrance. This is where florals, spices, and fruity accords take center stage, creating a harmonious and complex bouquet. The middle notes provide the body and character, revealing the true essence of the fragrance. The base notes anchor the composition, adding depth and longevity. Woods, resins, and balsamic notes often dominate the base, lingering on the skin and creating the lasting impression of the fragrance. The alchemy of blending. A symphony of harmony, the art of blending, is the essence of perfumery craftsmanship. Perfumers meticulously combine various raw materials, experimenting with proportions and nuances to achieve the desired olfactory harmony. It's a process of trial and error, where intuition, experience, and creativity play pivotal roles. Blending is not only about achieving the right balance of individual notes, but also about creating a seamless transition from one phase of the fragrance to another. The craftsmanship lies in the perfumer's ability to foresee how the scent will evolve over time on the skin and ensure that each note contributes to the overall olfactory narrative. Perfumers often use a modified organ, a set of glass vials containing individual fragrance materials, to create their compositions. This allows them to smell and compare different combinations, fine-tuning the blend until they achieve the perfect accord. It's a laborious and patient process that demands both technical expertise and a highly developed sense of olfactory intuition. The role of creativity. Crafting unique signatures. Craftsmanship in scent creation is not merely about replicating formulas, but about infusing each fragrance with a unique and distinctive character. Perfumers are artists, and their craft involves the exploration of creativity to convey emotions and stories through scent. A master perfumer develops a signature style, a unique olfactory fingerprint that sets their creations apart. This signature may be evident in the choice of certain notes, the emphasis on a particular accord, or the overall aesthetic of their fragrances. Creativity is the spark that transforms a blend of raw materials into a work of art that resonates with the perfumer's vision and the emotions they seek to evoke. Precision and calculation. The science of perfumery. Craftsmanship in scent creation also involves a scientific understanding of the chemical properties of fragrance materials. Perfumers must be familiar with the volatility, solubility, and molecular structures of each ingredient to create stable and harmonious compositions. This scientific knowledge allows them to predict how a fragrance will perform over time and under different conditions. Modern perfumery often involves the use of headspace technology gas chromatography, and mass spectrometry to analyze and recreate specific scents. Perfumers use these tools to deconstruct and understand the olfactory profiles of natural ingredients, 
allowing for the precise replication or enhancement of certain scent characteristics. The Perfumer's Lab, a sanctuary of creativity. The Perfumer's Lab is a sanctuary where creativity and craftsmanship converge. Equipped with rows of aroma compounds, essential oils, and blending tools, the lab is where the magic happens. It's a space for experimentation, exploration, and the pursuit of olfactory excellence. The crafting process often begins with inspiration, be it a memory, a piece of art, or a specific emotion the perfumer wishes to capture. From there, the raw materials are carefully chosen, measured, and combined. The perfumer's lab is a realm where intuition guides the hands, and precision ensures the balance of each note. Crafting for diverse tastes, Niche and mainstream perfumery. Perfumery craftsmanship takes different forms in both niche and mainstream fragrance creation. In mainstream perfumery, where accessibility and broad appeal are key, the challenge lies in crafting scents that resonate with a diverse consumer base. These fragrances often follow popular trends and are meticulously calibrated to ensure widespread acceptance. In niche perfumery, on the other hand, Perfumers have more artistic freedom. They can explore unconventional combinations, rare ingredients, and avant-garde concepts. Miche fragrances often cater to a more discerning audience seeking unique and distinctive olfactory experiences. The legacy of master perfumers, passing down the craft. Craftsmanship in scent creation is a tradition passed down through generations. Master perfumers, revered for their contributions to the art, often mentor aspiring perfumers, sharing their knowledge, techniques, and insights. This mentorship fosters a continuity of craftsmanship, ensuring that the art of perfumery evolves while preserving its rich heritage. Conclusion The craftsmanship of scent as an artistic legacy in the realm of scent creation Craftsmanship is the invisible thread that weaves together the tapestry of fragrances. It is the artful synthesis of creativity technical expertise and a deep understanding of raw materials that transforms a blend of ingredients into a symphony of scent. Perfumers, as true artisans, leave their mark on the world through the fragrances. They create a legacy that transcends time, resonates with emotions, and becomes an integral part of the human experience. The craftsmanship of scent creation is a timeless art a journey of exploration and discovery that continues to captivate the senses and enrich our olfactory landscape. Chapter 3. The Perfumed Pages of History The evolution of perfumery is a captivating journey that unfolds through the annals of ancient civilizations, royal courts and cultural movements, weaving a fragrant tapestry that mirrors the changing landscapes of human history. From the aromatic rituals of ancient Egypt to the opulent courts of Renaissance Europe, and the revolutionary shifts brought by cultural movements, pivotal moments and influences have shaped the narrative of perfumery, elevating it from a simple sensory delight to an art form that transcends time and borders. 1. Ancient Civilizations The origins of perfumery The roots of perfumery can be traced back to the ancient civilizations of Mesopotamia, Egypt, and the Indus Valley. In these early cultures, Fragrant substances were revered for their religious, medicinal, and cosmetic properties. Ancient Egyptians, in particular, embraced perfumery with fervor, using aromatic oils and resins in religious ceremonies, mummification, and personal adornment. Egyptian hieroglyphs and archaeological discoveries reveal the significance of fragrances in daily life. The legendary perfume Kaifai, a complex blend of myrrh, frankincense, honey, and other aromatic ingredients, was crafted for religious rites. The process of extracting essential oils from flowers and herbs was documented in ancient texts, laying the foundation for the art of perfumery. 2. Greece and Rome. Aromatic extravagance. The fragrance journey continued into ancient Greece and Rome, where perfumery became an indulgence of the elite. Influenced by the aromatic practices of the East, the Greeks and Romans embraced the art of perfumery for personal pleasure and as symbols of status. Bath houses were scented with exotic oils, and fragrant unguents adorned the skin of the wealthy. One of the most celebrated figures in ancient perfumery was the Greek physician and botanist Dioscorides, whose work De Materia Medica became a reference for aromatic substances. Romans, enamoured with luxurious scents, adorned themselves with perfumed oils and balms, 
and the demand for rare fragrant ingredients grew. 3. Islamic Golden Age Distillation and Innovation During the Islamic Golden Age, perfumery reached new heights of innovation. Arab chemists and perfumers revolutionized the extraction process by developing the technique of distillation. This breakthrough allowed for the extraction of essential oils with greater efficiency, expanding the perfumer's palate. Influential figures like Avicenna, a Persian polymath, contributed to the understanding of distillation and the classification of aromatic substances. Perfumery thrived in the Islamic world, becoming a refined art form celebrated in courts and marketplaces alike. 4. The Renaissance Perfume in the courts of Europe The Renaissance marked a resurgence of interest in art, culture, and aesthetics in Europe, and perfumery became an integral part of courtly life. Italian and French courts were at the forefront of this olfactory renaissance, with Catherine de' Medici bringing the art of perfumery to the French court upon her marriage to Henry II. The Italian city of Florence emerged as a centre for perfume production, with renowned perfumers like Caterina Sforza creating exquisite fragrances for the nobility. The Renaissance saw the birth of iconic fragrances, such as the Hungary Water, a concoction of rosemary and distilled alcohol favoured by Queen Elizabeth of Hungary. 5. The Birth of Modern Perfumery Eau de Cologne and Guilaine, the 18th century witnessed the birth of modern perfumery, marked by the creation of Eau de Cologne. Italian perfumer Giovanni Maria Farina crafted this refreshing blend of citrus oils and herbs in Cologne, Germany. Eau de Cologne's light and invigorating composition contrasted with the heavier scents of the time, establishing a new olfactory trend that persists to this day. In the 19th century, the House of Guerlain, founded by Pierre-Francois Pascal Guerlain, became a trailblazer in the world of perfumery. Guerlain's creations, including Jicky and Shalima, showcased a masterful blending of natural essences and innovative techniques. These fragrances set the stage for the artistry and innovation that would define the modern perfume industry. 6. Art Nouveau and Art Deco perfume as objets d'art. The Art Nouveau and Art Deco movements of the late 19th and early 20th centuries brought a new dimension to perfumery, elevating fragrance bottles to the status of objets d'art. René Lalique, a master glassmaker and jeweller, collaborated with renowned perfumer Francois Coty to create exquisite perfume bottles adorned with intricate designs. Perfume became an integral part of the fashion and luxury industries, with iconic fragrances such as Chanel No. 5. And Jean Patou's joy capturing the spirit of the times. The interplay between visual aesthetics and olfactory experiences underscored the role of perfumery as a multisensory art form. 7. Mid 20th century. The rise of niche and designer fragrances. The mid 20th century witnessed the emergence of designer fragrances and the democratization of perfume consumption. Influential designers like Christian Dior, Yves Saint Laurent, and Coco Chanel expanded their fashion houses to include signature fragrances, creating scents that embodied the spirit of their brands. Simultaneously, the rise of niche perfumery challenged the mainstream with unique and unconventional creations. Independent perfumers, unconstrained by mass market demands, crafted fragrances that catered to a more discerning and diverse audience. 8. Contemporary Perfumery Trends, Technology and Sustainability In the 21st century, perfumery continues to evolve with changing consumer preferences, technological advancements, and a growing emphasis on sustainability. The industry has witnessed a resurgence of interest in natural and niche fragrances, with a focus on artisanal craftsmanship and storytelling. Advancements in technology, such as headspace analysis and molecular distillation, have revolutionized the extraction and creation of fragrances. Synthetic molecules, once viewed as avant-garde, have become integral to modern perfumery, offering perfumers a vast palette of possibilities. Sustainability has become a key concern, leading to the exploration of eco-friendly practices, ethical sourcing of raw materials, and a shift towards transparent and responsible fragrance production. Conclusion A fragrant tapestry unfolding The evolution of perfumery is a rich and complex narrative, a fragrant tapestry woven through the epochs of human civilization, from the sacred rituals of ancient cultures to the opulence of royal courts, and the artistic revolutions of the Renaissance to the contemporary trends shaping the industry, 
Perfumery reflects the essence of the times. Pivotal moments and influential figures have left an indelible mark on the story of perfumery, transforming it from a utilitarian practice into a refined art form. Today, as perfumers draw inspiration from the past while embracing innovation, the fragrance industry continues to unfold, offering an ever-expanding olfactory landscape that captivates the senses and transcends cultural boundaries. The narrative of perfumery remains an ongoing saga, a testament to the enduring allure and artistic potential of scent. The spiritual significance of incense in ancient rituals and its aromatic indulgences in Renaissance courts form a captivating chapter in the scented history of humanity. From the sacred spaces of ancient temples to the opulent chambers of European royalty, incense has transcended its utilitarian origins to become a symbol of the divine, a conduit for spiritual connection, and an olfactory indulgence that defined cultural epochs. 1. Ancient Rituals the incense path to the divine incense, with its ethereal smoke and aromatical yore, has been intertwined with spiritual practices since time immemorial. In ancient civilizations, the use of incense was not merely a sensory delight, but a sacred ritual, a bridge between the earthly and the divine. Egypt. Fragrance for the gods. In ancient Egypt, Incense played a central role in religious ceremonies. The fragrant tendrils of incense smoke were believed to carry prayers and offerings to the gods. Precious resins like myrrh and frankincense, sourced from exotic lands, were burned in temples to honor deities and purify sacred spaces. The scent of incense wafting through the air became synonymous with the presence of the divine. India. The aromas of yoga and meditation. In the ancient traditions of India, Incense was an integral part of spiritual practices, including yoga and meditation. The art of crafting incense, known as agarbati, was perfected, blending aromatic woods, resins and herbs to create scents that facilitated focus and introspection. The rising smoke symbolized the ascent of prayers and the purification of the mind. China. Harmony through fragrance. In ancient China, Incense became a symbol of harmony and balance. The practice of Shongdao or incense way involved the use of incense in Taoist and Buddhist rituals. The careful selection and blending of aromatic materials were believed to bring about a sense of tranquility and spiritual alignment. 2. The Renaissance Courts, a fragrant resurgence. The Renaissance era witnessed a resurgence of interest in art, culture, and the sensory pleasures of life. In the courts of Europe, including those of Italy and France, Incense emerged as a symbol of luxury, refinement, and spiritual elevation. Italy. Aromatic extravagance. In Renaissance Italy, particularly during the Medici rule, incense was embraced as a symbol of opulence. The Medici family, known for their patronage of the arts, sought to surround themselves with the nest's sensory experiences. Incense burners adorned their palaces, releasing fragrant plumes that added to the ambience of grandeur and sophistication. France. The fragrant influence of Catherine de Medici. The aromatic legacy of the Medici family extended beyond Italy to the courts of France, thanks to the marriage of Catherine de Medici to Henry II. Catherine, a connoisseur of scents, introduced the French court to the aromatic indulgences she had inherited. Incense became a staple in the courts, used not only for religious ceremonies, but also as a mark of social distinction and elegance. 3. The art of perfumery and incense in Renaissance Europe. The Renaissance era was not only marked by the use of raw incense, but also witnessed the emergence of perfumed incense and scented sachets. Perfumers, inspired by the aromatic preferences of the aristocracy, began blending incense with other fragrant materials to create bespoke scents that adorned clothing, linens, and living spaces. Catherine de Medici's influence on perfumery. Catherine de Medici's influence extended beyond incense to the broader world of perfumery. She is often credited with introducing the concept of personal fragrance to the French court. Perfumed gloves, scented fans, and fragrant pomanders filled with a blend of spices and resins became fashionable accessories marking the intersection of personal luxury and olfactory indulgence. 4. The Symbolism of Incense Aromatic Alchemy The spiritual significance of incense in ancient rituals and Renaissance courts transcends its aromatical lure. Incense, with its transformative smoke and evocative scents, 
represents a form of aromatic alchemy, a convergence of the physical and metaphysical, purification and sanctification. In ancient rituals, the burning of incense served as a purifying agent. The rising smoke was believed to cleanse the air, dispel negative energies, and sanctify the space. This purification ritual extended to individuals, with the fragrant smoke symbolizing a spiritual cleansing and preparation for divine connection. Elevating the soul, the aroma of incense was thought to elevate the soul, providing a sensory link to the spiritual realm. The act of inhaling fragrant smoke during meditation or prayer became a conduit for transcendence, creating an immersive experience that heightened the senses and facilitated a deeper connection with the divine. Symbol of wealth and prestige, in Renaissance courts, the use of incense went beyond spiritual symbolism. It became a symbol of wealth, prestige, and cultural refinement. The fragrance of burning incense was associated with luxury, sophistication, and the elevated tastes of the aristocracy. Incense burners, often crafted from precious metals and adorned with intricate designs, became status symbols within the opulent chambers of European courts. Aesthetic and sensory pleasure. The Renaissance marked a shift from the purely utilitarian use of incense to an appreciation for its aesthetic and sensory pleasures. Perfumers, inspired by the artistic movements of the time, began to blend incense with other fragrant ingredients, creating bespoke scents that adorned both the body and living spaces. The aromatic indulgences of Renaissance courts became a harmonious marriage of sensory delight and cultural expression. 5. Legacy and Contemporary Resonance The spiritual significance of incense in ancient rituals and its aromatic indulgences in Renaissance courts have left an enduring legacy. In contemporary times, Incense continues to be a symbol of both sacred and secular rituals. From religious ceremonies to meditation practices and luxury perfumery, the fragrant tendrils of incense persist as a timeless connection between the material and the spiritual. The spiritual resonance of incense induces in various cultures and belief systems, with the act of burning incense remaining a powerful and symbolic practice. Its aromatic allure, once exclusive to royal courts, has become accessible to a global audience, with a diverse array of incense blends catering to individual preferences and spiritual inclinations. In conclusion, the spiritual significance of incense in ancient rituals and the aromatic indulgences of Renaissance courts form a rich narrative that speaks to the enduring relationship between humanity and fragrance, whether in the sacred temples of ancient civilizations or the ornate chambers of European royalty. Incense has woven itself into the fabric of our sensory and spiritual experiences, transcending time and leaving an aromatic legacy that continues to captivate the senses and elevate the soul. The history of fragrance unfolds as a rich tapestry, woven across civilizations and centuries, where scents have emerged as emblems of elegance, power, and cultural expression. From ancient rituals to the courts of royalty and into the contemporary era, Fragrances have been more than mere olfactory adornments. They have served as symbols, cultural ambassadors, and expressions of identity, leaving an indelible mark on the sensory landscape of human history. 1. Ancient Civilizations Aromatic Traditions In the ancient world, fragrances held a sacred and symbolic significance, intertwining with religious practices, cultural rituals, and personal adornment. Mesopotamia, Egypt, and the Indus Valley were pioneers in cultivating aromatic traditions that transcended the utilitarian. Egypt, perfumed path to the divine. In ancient Egypt, fragrance was intimately linked to spirituality. Perfumed oils and incense were central to religious ceremonies, believed to purify the air and act as offerings to the gods. The famous perfume houses of ancient Egypt produced exquisite scents, with ingredients like myrrh, frankincense, and lotus contributing to the olfactory tapestry of the Nile. Greece and Rome, elegance and extravagance. The ancient Greeks and Romans elevated fragrance to a symbol of elegance and indulgence. Perfumed oils, unguents, and balms adorned both men and women, becoming integral to daily grooming rituals. The use of scents in public spaces, such as bathhouses, exemplified a collective appreciation for olfactory pleasure. China and India. Fragrant trails of tradition. In China and India, 
fragrance became an essential element of cultural expression. Incense played a crucial role in religious ceremonies and meditation practices. The art of crafting perfumes, sachets, and scented materials became a reflection of cultural aesthetics, and the Silk Road facilitated the exchange of aromatic treasures, fostering cross-cultural olfactory influences. 2. Renaissance Europe Perfume and Power The Renaissance witnessed a resurgence of interest in art, culture, and refinement in Europe. Perfume, as a symbol of luxury and status, became intertwined with the power dynamics of the time. Italy, Medici and the Aromatic Renaissance The Medici family in Italy, known for their patronage of the arts, embraced fragrance as a means of cultural expression. Catherine de' Medici, upon her marriage to Henry II of France, introduced the art of perfumery to the French court, leaving an indelible mark on European fragrance traditions. France, perfumed courts of Versailles. The court of Versailles under Louis XIV became a symbol of extravagance and sophistication. Perfumed gloves, pomades, and scented fans were not just personal luxuries, but statements of social standing. Perfume became a reflection of power, with royal perfumers crafting bespoke scents for the monarchy. Three. The Industrial Revolution Accessibility and Ubiquity The Industrial Revolution marked a shift in the accessibility and production of fragrances. Advances in technology and chemistry allowed for mass production, democratizing the use of scents beyond the elite. Bourgeoisie and the middle class As the middle class emerged, so did the demand for affordable fragrances. Perfume houses adapted their production methods to cater to a broader audience. The rise of department stores and the availability of fragrances for everyday use transformed scent from a luxury reserved for the elite to an accessible form of personal expression. 4. Art Deco and the Roaring Twenties Fragrance as fashion. The Roaring Twenties and the Art Deco era saw a fusion of fragrance with fashion and lifestyle. Iconic fragrances like Chanel No. 5 embodied the spirit of the times, becoming essential accessories for the fashionable elite. Perfume bottles became OJ's dart, and scents were tailored to match the changing aesthetics of the era. 5. Post War Boom. Marketing and Globalization. The post war era marked a boom in the fragrance industry with marketing strategies and globalization playing pivotal roles in shaping the narrative of perfumery. Celebrity endorsements and branding. The mid-20th century saw the rise of celebrity endorsements, with Hollywood icons becoming the faces of popular fragrances. Perfume became a tool for personal branding, and the industry capitalized on the allure of glamour and celebrity. Global influence and cultural exchange. Advancements in transportation and communication facilitated the global exchange of fragrances. Different cultures and their olfactory traditions began influencing one another, leading to the creation of scents that resonated across borders. Fragrances became cultural ambassadors, carrying the essence of diverse traditions. 6. Contemporary Fragrance Landscape Identity and Innovation In the Contemporary Fragrance Landscape Scents have become a canvas for personal identity and a playground for innovative creativity. Niche fragrance houses. Crafting identities, niche fragrance houses have emerged, catering to individuals seeking unique and personalized scents. These fragrances often tell stories, evoke emotions, and reflect the wearer's distinct identity, challenging the mass market homogenization of scents. Sustainability and ethical practices. The 21st century has seen a growing emphasis on sustainability and ethical practices within the fragrance industry. Consumers are increasingly conscious of the environmental impact of perfume production, leading to a shift toward eco-friendly and responsibly sourced ingredients. Innovation and olfactory art Advancements in scent technology and the incorporation of cutting-edge materials have pushed the boundaries of olfactory art. Perfumers are embracing unconventional ingredients, from molecular compounds to rare botanicals, creating avant-garde scents that challenge traditional olfactory norms. Conclusion Fragrance as a cultural tapestry The journey of fragrance as an emblem of elegance, power, and cultural expression across civilizations and centuries weaves a cultural tapestry that reflects the evolution of societies, tastes, and identities. From ancient rituals to contemporary innovations, fragrances have been integral to the human experience, 
transcending mere sense to become carriers of history, tradition, and personal narratives. In each waft of fragrance, we encounter a sensory chapter of our shared cultural odyssey. Chapter 4. Elegance in a Bottle the art of perfume design. Perfume design is an intricate and nuanced process that involves a harmonious blend of artistry, science, and olfactory expertise. From the initial spark of inspiration to the final bottled fragrance, the journey of creating a perfume is a meticulous and creative endeavor that unfolds through several distinct stages. 1. Conceptualization. The birth of an idea. The journey begins with the conceptualization phase where the perfumer or fragrance designer envisions the essence of the fragrance. This phase is akin to crafting a narrative, where the scent becomes a story told through olfactory notes. Inspiration can be drawn from a myriad of sources nature, memories, emotions, art, or even abstract concepts. The perfumer may create a mood board, sketching out the envisioned atmosphere colors and emotions associated with the fragrance. This initial step lays the foundation for the olfactory journey that will unfold in the subsequent stages. 2. Raw Material Selection The olfactory palette. Once the concept is crystallized, the perfumer turns to the olfactory palette a vast array of raw materials that includes essential oils, absolutes, synthetic molecules, and aroma compounds. Each raw material contributes its unique character ranging from floral and fruity notes to woody and spicy nuances. The perfumer carefully selects ingredients based on their olfactory profiles, ensuring that they align with the intended theme and mood of the fragrance. This process involves not only technical expertise, but also a deep understanding of the interplay between different notes with the chosen raw materials in hand. The perfumer begins the art of formulation. Fragrance formulation is akin to composing a symphony, where individual notes and accords harmonize to create a cohesive and balanced composition. Accords are synergistic combinations of multiple ingredients that create a specific olfactory impression. For example, a floral accord may combine rose, jasmine, and ilang ilang to evoke a bouquet of flowers. The perfumer meticulously adjusts the proportions of each ingredient to achieve the desired balance and character. 4. Trial and Error Iterative refinement. Creating a fragrance is a process of continuous refinement. The perfumer crafts multiple iterations, refining and adjusting the formula based on sensory evaluations. Each trial brings the fragrance closer to the envisioned concept, with the perfumer relying on their olfactory intuition to navigate the intricate landscape of scent. During this phase, the perfumer may work with a perfumery organ, a tool that helps categorize and evaluate the olfactory characteristics of different ingredients. This aids in fine-tuning the balance of top, middle, and base notes, ensuring a dynamic and evolving fragrance experience. 5. Evaluation and Testing The olfactory journey as the fragrance takes shape. It undergoes rigorous evaluation through various stages of development. Perfumers often collaborate with sensory panels or focus groups to gather diverse perspectives on the scent. This iterative process of evaluation and feedback helps the perfumer refine the fragrance until it achieves the desired olfactory profile. Testing also involves assessing the longevity and silage trail left by the fragrance of the scent. The interaction of the fragrance with the skin and its evolution over time are crucial considerations to ensure a well-rounded and enduring olfactory experience. 6. Stability Testing Ensuring longevity. Perfumes are complex compositions that can be sensitive to environmental factors such as light, temperature, and air. Stability testing involves subjecting the fragrance to various conditions to ensure its longevity and consistency over time. This step is essential to guarantee that the fragrance remains true to its original formulation and does not undergo undesirable changes. 7. Regulatory Compliance Navigating industry standards, the fragrance industry is subject to stringent regulations to ensure the safety and compliance of perfumes. Perfumers must adhere to international and regional standards, including the International Fragrance Association IFRA, guidelines. This involves verifying the safety of individual ingredients and ensuring that the final formulation complies with regulatory limits. 8. Final Formulation 
crafting the signature scent. Once the fragrance has passed through the rigorous stages of development, evaluation, and compliance, the final formulation is crafted. This is the signature scent that encapsulates the perfumer's vision and the essence of the initial concept. The fragrance is now ready to be bottled and presented to the world. 9. Packaging and Presentation the art of visual expression. The journey of perfume design extends beyond the liquid within the bottle to the visual expression of the packaging. The bottle, label, and overall presentation are integral components of the perfume's identity. The packaging serves as a visual representation of the fragrance, enhancing the overall sensorial experience for the consumer. 10. Launch and Marketing Sharing the olfactory story. The final step in the process of perfume design is the launch and marketing phase. Perfume houses unveil their creations to the public, accompanied by storytelling, branding, and marketing campaigns. The narrative behind the fragrance, the inspiration, and the intended emotions are conveyed to consumers, inviting them to embark on the olfactory journey crafted by the perfumer. Conclusion A Symphony of Scent in the intricate process of perfume design, from conceptualization to creation, perfumers orchestrate a symphony of scent that resonates with the human experience. Each fragrance is a unique expression, a sensory masterpiece grafted through a blend of art, science, and olfactory intuition. From the initial spark of inspiration to the final unveiling, the journey of creating a perfume is a testament to the enduring allure and artistic potential of scent in the world of perfumery. The creative journey that transforms inspiration, emotion and technical expertise into breathtaking flacons of liquid elegance is a nuanced and captivating process in the world of perfumery. From the initial spark of inspiration to the final presentation of a meticulously crafted fragrance, Perfumers embark on a sensory odyssey that transcends the boundaries of art and science, resulting in olfactory masterpieces encased in exquisite bottles. 1. The Alchemy of Inspiration Unveiling the muse, the journey begins with inspiration, an intangible force that sparks the creative process. The perfumer seeks inspiration from a myriad of sources, ranging from nature's landscapes and cultural traditions to personal memories and emotions. This initial moment of inspiration serves as the muse that guides the perfumer's olfactory exploration. Nature often plays a significant role in providing a rich tapestry of scents. A walk through a blooming garden, the aroma of a tropical rainforest, or the crisp air of a mountain landscape can trigger ideas for fragrances that capture the essence of these experiences. Alternatively, Cultural influences, art, literature, and even abstract concepts can serve as wellsprings of inspiration. 2. The Olfactory Palette Selecting the ingredients, with the muse in mind, the perfumer turns to the olfactory palette a vast array of raw materials that includes essential oils, absolutes, resins, and synthetic molecules. Each ingredient is carefully selected for its olfactory profile contributing a unique facet to the fragrance. The perfumer's expertise lies in understanding not only the individual characteristics of each ingredient, but also their interactions. They navigate the intricate balance of top, middle, and base notes, ensuring a dynamic and harmonious composition. The olfactory palette becomes a canvas upon which the perfumer will paint the olfactory portrait of their inspiration. 3. Emotional Expression Infusing the fragrance with feeling, perfumery is an art form that transcends the purely technical. Emotion plays a pivotal role in the creative process, as the perfumer seeks to infuse the fragrance with a specific mood, sentiment, or evocative power. The selected notes become emotional triggers, capable of stirring memories, eliciting feelings, and resonating with the human experience. For example, a perfumer aiming to create a romantic fragrance may blend floral notes like rose and jasmine with warm, sensual accords. The goal is not only to capture the olfactory beauty of these ingredients, but also to evoke the emotions associated with romance. This emotional layering adds depth and complexity to the fragrance, transforming it into a nuanced expression of the perfumer's artistic intent. 4. Artistic Formulation Crafting the symphony of notes, the formulation process is akin to composing a symphony, 
with each note and accord contributing to the overall harmony. Perfumers create accords carefully balanced combinations of multiple ingredients that evoke specific olfactory impressions. These accords are the building blocks of the fragrance, each one playing a role in the unfolding narrative of the scent. The perfumer meticulously weighs and blends the ingredients, adjusting proportions to achieve the desired balance and character. This stage requires not only technical skill, but also a finely tuned olfactory intuition. Perfumers often work with a perfumery organ, an olfactory classification tool to categorize and evaluate the omas of different ingredients. 5. Iterative Refinement Crafting the olfactory masterpiece, creating a fragrance, is an iterative process of refinement. The perfumer crafts multiple versions of the scent, each one a step closer to the envisioned masterpiece. Each iteration is tested, evaluated, and adjusted based on sensory feedback. This iterative refinement is a dance between the perfumer's vision and the practical realities of scent. The fragrance may evolve as unexpected nuances emerge during the formulation process. Perfumers rely on their olfactory expertise to navigate this journey, adjusting the composition until it aligns with the original inspiration and emotional intent. 6. Technical Expertise the science of scent. While the creative process is deeply artistic, perfumery is also rooted in scientific principles. Perfumers must understand the chemical composition of each ingredient, its volatility, and its interactions with other materials. This technical expertise is crucial in achieving the desired longevity, projection, and overall performance of the fragrance. The perfumer must also consider the regulatory landscape ensuring that the formulation complies with industry standards and safety regulations. This balance between art and science requires a multidisciplinary approach, where creativity is guided by a profound understanding of the materials and their chemical properties. 7. Storytelling through scent. The fragrance narrative. A fragrance is more than a combination of pleasant aromas. It is a narrative told through scent. Perfumers aim to craft a fragrance with a distinctive personality, a story that unfolds on the skin. This storytelling aspect enhances the emotional connection between the wearer and the fragrance. The fragrance narrative encompasses the evolution of the scent over time, how it unfolds from the initial spritz to the lingering bass notes. Perfumers often conceptualize the fragrance as a journey with distinct chapters, creating a dynamic and captivating olfactory experience. 8. Presentation. The art of bottling elegance. Once the fragrance has been perfected, attention turns to its presentation, the visual embodiment of the olfactory masterpiece. The bottle design, label, and packaging become integral elements of the overall sensory experience. Perfume houses collaborate with designers to create flacons that not only protect the precious liquid within, but also serve as object start. The design of the bottle often reflects the inspiration behind the fragrance. It may evoke the natural elements that influence the scent or embody the mood and aesthetics of the narrative. The combination of the liquid within and the external aesthetics creates a complete work of art that engages multiple senses. 9. Launch and Reception Sharing the artistic vision, the final step in the creative journey, is the launch of the fragrance. Perfume houses unveil their creations to the world, accompanied by storytelling, branding, and marketing campaigns. The perfume is introduced to the public as an artistic expression, inviting consumers to explore the olfactory world crafted by the perfumer. The reception of a fragrance is a culmination of the perfumer's creative vision meeting the diverse interpretations of individuals. A well-received fragrance resonates with consumers, creating a shared experience that transcends the boundaries of the perfumer's studio. 10. Legacy and Evolution A timeless olfactory tale as a fragrance stakes its place in the world. It becomes part of the rich legacy of perfumery. Iconic scents leave an indelible mark on the industry, influencing future creations and becoming part of the olfactory tapestry of cultural history. The creative journey that transforms inspiration, emotion and technical expertise into breathtaking flacons of liquid elegance is a testament to the alchemy of perfumery. It is a journey that continues to evolve, with each fragrance contributing to the ongoing narrative of scent, a timeless tale of artistry, 
emotion, and the boundless possibilities of olfaction. In every elegant flacon lies not just a liquid, but an olfactory masterpiece waiting to be experienced and cherished. Chapter 5 the elegance of scent and self, the art of scent layering and perfumery customization, is a sensory journey that empowers individuals to craft a unique olfactory signature. Far beyond the simple act of applying a single fragrance, this approach involves the intentional blending of multiple scents to create a personalized and nuanced aroma that reflects one's personality, mood, and style. Scent layering is an art form that invites exploration, experimentation, and the creation of a bespoke fragrance experience. 1. The Palette of Possibilities Exploring Fragrance Families Scent layering begins with an understanding of fragrance families the overarching categories that encompass a range of olfactory notes. Perfumery is often categorized into families such as floral, oriental, woody, citrus, and aquatic, each offering a distinct character. Exploring these families provides the foundation for creating harmonious scent combinations. Floral Floral fragrances feature the essences of flowers like rose, jasmine and lavender, offering a romantic and feminine touch. Oriental. Rich and warm, oriental fragrances often include spices, vanilla, and resins, evoking a sense of luxury and sensuality. Woody. Woody scents incorporate notes like cedar, sandalwood, and vetiver, conveying earthiness and sophistication. Citrus are vibrant and refreshing. Citrus fragrances showcase notes like lemon, orange, and bergamot, providing an invigorating touch. Aquatic. Inspired by the sea, aquatic fragrances often include marine notes, offering a fresh and breezy feel. Understanding these families allows individuals to curate a collection of scents that can be layered to achieve a desired olfactory experience. 2. Building the olfactory composition. Layering techniques. Scent layering involves applying multiple fragrances in a strategic manner, considering the evaporation rates and characteristics of each scent. Here are several techniques to master the art of layering. Top-down layering. Start with a light, fresh fragrance as the base, top note, and layer a more robust scent, middle or base note, on top. This allows for a dynamic and evolving fragrance experience. Blend similar families. Combine fragrances from the same family to create depth and complexity. For example, Layering different floral scents can result in a bouquet of nuanced aromas. Contrasting elements. Experiment with contrasts by layering fragrances with opposing characteristics. Pair a citrusy top note with a warm and spicy base note for a dynamic contrast. Single family intensity. If a single fragrance family dominates, layering scents within that family can enhance the overall intensity and longevity of the aroma. Seasonal adaptation. Adjust your fragrance combination based on the season. Lighter, fresher scents may be preferred in warmer months, while richer, warmer notes can be layered during colder seasons. 3. Personal expression. Tailoring fragrance to mood and style. The beauty of scent layering lies in its capacity for personal expression. Perfumery customization allows individuals to tailor their fragrance to suit specific moods, occasions, or even different aspects of their personality. Day to night transition. Create a seamless transition from day to night by layering a lighter, more casual fragrance for the day and adding a more intense, alluring note for the evening. Work versus play. Customize your scent for different settings. Opt for a subtle, office friendly fragrance during working hours and layer on a bolder scent for social events. Signature style. Develop a signature fragrance that becomes synonymous with your personal style. By layering scents that resonate with you, you can craft a unique olfactory identity. Seasonal variations. Embrace the changing seasons by adjusting your fragrance combination. Lighter, floral scents may be ideal for spring, while warm, spicy notes evoke the coziness of winter. 4. Fragrance wardrobe. Curating a collection. Assembling a fragrance wardrobe is akin to building a versatile collection of scents that cater to different moods and occasions. Rather than relying on a single signature scent, individuals can curate a selection of fragrances that can be mixed and matched to suit various preferences. Diversity in notes. Ensure your fragrance collection spans a diverse range of notes, 
from fresh and zesty to warm and woody. This ensures flexibility in layering combinations. Travel-friendly options. Consider compact or travel-sized fragrances for on-the-go customization. These can be easily combined to create unique blends wherever you are. Scent pairing exploration. Dedicate time to experimenting with different scent pairings. Take note of combinations that resonate with you and evoke positive emotions. 5. Artisanal and niche fragrances. Embracing unconventional combinations. Artisanal and niche fragrances often feature unconventional and unique scent combinations, providing a playground for olfactory exploration. These fragrances, crafted with a focus on creativity and individuality, can serve as the building blocks for personalized layering experiences. Unusual pairings. Embrace the unexpected by combining fragrances with unusual or rare notes. Niche perfumers often push boundaries, offering intriguing combinations that can redefine traditional notions of scent. Limited edition releases. Keep an eye on limited edition releases from niche perfumers. These unique creations can become prized elements in your fragrance wardrobe, offering exclusive options for layering. 6. Practical tips. Do's and don'ts of layering. While the art of scent layering is highly subjective, there are some practical tips to enhance the experience. Do's. Start light. Begin with a light application of each fragrance, as layering can intensify the overall scent. Blend strategically. Focus on specific pulse points, such as wrists and neck, for an even distribution of fragrance. Consider concentrations. Layering works well with different concentrations, e.g. eau de toilette and eau de perfume of the same fragrance. Experiment gradually. Introduce one new layer at a time to understand how different scents interact. Don'ts. Overwhelm with intensity. Avoid overloading on intense fragrances, especially in shared spaces. Neglect allergies. Be mindful of potential allergies and sensitivities when layering multiple scents. Ignore evaporation rates. Consider the evaporation rates of fragrances. Layering a fast evaporating scent over a slow evaporating one may result in an uneven experience. 7. Embracing the journey, ongoing exploration and discovery. Scent layering is a continuous journey of exploration and discovery. Fragrance preferences evolve, and the art of layering invites individuals to embrace the dynamic nature of their olfactory journey. Seasonal update. Rotate and update your fragrance combinations with the changing seasons to align with your evolving tastes and preferences. Stay open-minded. Be open to unexpected discoveries. A chance combination may lead to a new found favorite blend. Community exploration. Engage with the fragrance community to share insights, tips and experiences. Online forums and communities offer a wealth of knowledge and inspiration. Conclusion. A symphony of personal fragrance, the art of scent layering and perfumery customization is a symphony of personal fragrance, where individuals become both composer and conductor. It is an exploration of olfactory creativity, offering the freedom to craft a fragrance experience that resonates with one's unique identity and style. Through thoughtful experimentation, a diverse fragrance, the intricate connections between fragrance, memory, and identity form a sensory tapestry that weaves through the fabric of our lives. Scents possess a remarkable ability to evoke memories, trigger emotions, and contribute to the construction of our personal identities. This complex interplay between olfaction, recollection, and self-perception underscores the profound impact that fragrances can have on our individual and collective experiences. 1. Olfactory memory. The pinnacle of recall. The relationship between fragrance and memory is often regarded as one of the most potent connections in the realm of sensory experiences. Unlike other senses, such as sight or touch, olfaction is directly linked to the limbic system, a part of the brain associated with emotions and memory. As a result, scents have a unique ability to evoke vivid and emotionally charged memories, often from the deepest recesses of our past. Consider the sudden rush of nostalgia when catching a quiff of a particular flower, the comforting scent of a childhood home, or the familiar aroma of a loved one's perfume. These olfactory triggers can transport us back in time, 
unlocking a cascade of memories that may have been dormant for years. The olfactory memory is not only remarkably accurate, but is also intricately tied to the emotions and sentiments associated with a specific moment. 2. Scent and Emotional Resonance a fragrant chronicle of life. Every individual's life journey is marked by a fragrant chronicle, a collection of scents that become entwined with significant moments, relationships, and emotions. Fragrances act as silent narrators, capturing the essence of experiences and encapsulating them in olfactory memories. The perfume worn on a momentous day, a wedding, a graduation, or a milestone achievement can forever become associated with the jubilant emotions of that occasion. Similarly, the scent of a familiar dish cooking in the kitchen may evoke the warmth and comfort of family gatherings. These olfactory imprints contribute to the emotional resonance of memories, creating a sensorial mosaic that shapes our personal narratives. 3. Perfume as Identity Crafting a fragrant persona, fragrance plays a pivotal role in shaping personal identity, functioning as an invisible accessory that leaves a lasting impression. The choice of perfume becomes an intimate expression of individuality, a deliberate selection that aligns with one's character, style, and aspirations. Certain scents become synonymous with specific personality traits or moods. A person who favors fresh and citrusy fragrances might be perceived as energetic and vibrant, while someone drawn to deep, woody notes might exude sophistication and warmth. Perfume, in this context, is a form of nonverbal communication, an olfactory language that communicates facets of one's identity to the world. 4. Cultural and familial fragrance heritage. Inheritance of scent. Fragrance is often passed down through generations, creating a familial olfactory heritage. Certain scents become emblematic of cultural practices, family traditions, or even geographical roots. For instance, the fragrance of incense may evoke memories of religious ceremonies, while the aroma of a specific spice blend could be a nod to ancestral culinary traditions. Inherited scents carry with them a sense of continuity and connection to the past. A grandparent's signature fragrance, for example, might serve as a tangible link to family history, creating a bridge between generations. This familial fragrance heritage contributes to a sense of belonging and roots, enriching one's identity with layers of shared olfactory experiences. 5. Fragrance and Emotional Expression An olfactory vocabulary just as language is a vehicle for expressing emotions, fragrance serves as a nuanced olfactory vocabulary. Individuals often gravitate towards specific scents based on their emotional needs or states of mind. A calming lavender fragrance may be chosen to alleviate stress, while a lively and uplifting citrus blend might be embraced for moments of joy. Fragrance becomes a tool for emotional regulation and expression. The act of selecting a perfume becomes a deliberate choice to enhance or alter one's mood, allowing individuals to curate their emotional landscapes through the olfactory notes they choose to wear. This connection between fragrance and emotional expression further underscores the intimate link between scent and identity. 6. Signature Scents the olfactory signature of self, many individuals develop a penchant for a particular fragrance, creating a signature scent that becomes synonymous with their presence. This olfactory signature becomes a defining aspect of their identity, leaving a lasting impression on those around them. The recognition of a familiar scent can evoke a sense of comfort, familiarity, or even anticipation. A signature scent can extend beyond personal preference, to become part of one's legacy a fragrance that lingers in the memories of others long after the individual has left a room. This olfactory legacy adds a timeless and enduring dimension to the construction of personal identity. 7. Fragrance Rituals Olfactory mockers of daily life, daily rituals, such as the application of perfume, become integral components of identity formation. The consistent use of a particular fragrance in specific contexts, whether for work, leisure, or special occasions, creates olfactory mockers that contribute to a sense of continuity and routine. The act of applying fragrance can also serve as a ritual of self-care and mindfulness. Choosing a scent for the day becomes a deliberate moment of reflection, allowing individuals to connect with their emotions, aspirations, and intentions. 8. Scent and Social Bonds 
olfactory threads of connection. Fragrance serves as an invisible thread that weaves through social bonds, connecting individuals in shared olfactory experiences. The scent of a loved one's perfume can evoke feelings of intimacy and closeness, while a familiar household aroma can signify the warmth of home. Cultural and societal norms also contribute to the communal aspect of fragrance. Certain scents may be associated with specific occasions, ceremonies, or communal spaces, creating a collective olfactory identity that binds communities together. 9. Adaptive nature of scent and identity. A fluid relationship, the relationship between fragrance, memory, and identity is dynamic and adaptive. As individuals undergo personal growth, life changes, and experiences accumulate, the olfactory palette of identity evolves. Scents that once held profound significance may take on new meanings, and the choice of fragrance may adapt to reflect shifts in personality, preferences, or aspirations. The fluid nature of this relationship allows for ongoing exploration and reinvention. Individuals can intentionally use fragrance as a tool for self-discovery, embracing the transformative power of scent to align with their evolving sense of self. Conclusion Fragrance as an evocative tapestry in the intricate interplay between fragrance, memory, and identity. A rich and evocative tapestry is woven one that encapsulates the essence of individual lives and shared human experiences. Fragrance becomes more than a sensory delight. It becomes a vessel for memories, a conduit for emotional expression, and a silent narrator of personal narratives. As individuals navigate the olfactory landscapes of their lives, they contribute to the collective olfactory tapestry of humanity, the scents that linger in the air the perfumes that grace the skin, and the aromas that define spaces become integral components of the complex and beautiful symphony of scent, memory, and identity. In this olfactory journey, individuals find not only a means of self-expression, but also a profound connection to the shared narratives that transcend time and borders. The contemporary landscape of niche perfumery is a captivating terrain where innovation, artistry, and personalization converge to redefine the olfactory experience. Niche perfumery, characterized by small batch productions, unique compositions, and a focus on craftsmanship, has emerged as a vibrant and dynamic sector within the fragrance industry. Within this space, a wave of burgeoning trends is reshaping how individuals engage with and personalize their scent experiences, creating a more intimate and tailored approach to fragrance. 1. Niche Perfumery Renaissance – An Artistic Resurgence In recent years, niche perfumery has experienced a renaissance, marked by a departure from mass-market fragrances and a return to the artisanal roots of perfumery. Independent perfumers and niche fragrance houses are pushing the boundaries of creativity, unshackled by commercial constraints, and embracing a more experimental and avant-garde approach to scent creation. Artistic freedom is a hallmark of niche perfumery, allowing perfumers to explore unconventional notes, rare ingredients, and boundary-pushing compositions. This has led to the creation of fragrances that defy traditional classifications, offering olfactory experiences that are as diverse and individual as the perfumers themselves. 2. Unconventional ingredients and creative alchemy. One of the defining features of contemporary niche perfumery is the use of unconventional and rare ingredients. Perfumers are venturing beyond the familiar floral and woody notes, incorporating unique elements such as rare resins, exotic spices, and even molecular compounds not traditionally associated with perfumery. This emphasis on creative alchemy extends to the extraction and sourcing of raw materials. Miche perfumers often collaborate directly with growers and extractors, ensuring a level of quality and authenticity that is challenging to achieve on a larger scale. This hands-on approach to ingredient selection contributes to the distinctiveness of niche fragrances. 3. Personalized scent journeys, customization and bespoke offerings. The contemporary niche perfumery landscape places a significant emphasis on personalized scent experiences. Perfume enthusiasts are increasingly seeking fragrances that resonate with their individual tastes and preferences, leading to a surge in customization and bespoke offerings. Niche perfume houses are responding to this demand by providing options for consumers to tailor their fragrances. Some brands offer customization services, 
allowing customers to choose specific notes or adjust the concentration of ingredients. Others go a step further, providing bespoke services where perfumers work directly with clients to create entirely unique and personalized scents. 4. Olfactory Exploration Limited editions and discovery sets, the notion of exploration is central to the contemporary niche perfumery ethos. Limited edition releases and discovery sets have become popular trends, offering consumers the opportunity to embark on olfactory journeys and explore a brand's range of fragrances. Limited editions often showcase a perfumer's experimental side, featuring compositions that may be bolder, more avant-garde, or tied to specific themes. These releases create a sense of exclusivity and anticipation among fragrance enthusiasts, encouraging them to engage with a brand's evolving narrative. Discovery sets, on the other hand, provide an accessible entry point into a perfume house's portfolio. These curated collections of smaller-sized bottles or samples allow consumers to sample a variety of scents, encouraging exploration and helping individuals discover fragrances that align with their preferences. 5. Gender fluidity in fragrance. Breaking traditional norms, contemporary niche perfumery is challenging and redefining traditional gender norms in fragrance. The binary classification of scents into masculine and feminine categories is giving way to a more fluid and inclusive approach. Niche brands are creating fragrances that transcend gender expectations, recognizing that scent preferences are inherently personal and not confined by societal norms. This shift towards gender-neutral or gender-fluid fragrances reflects a broader cultural movement towards inclusivity and individual expression. Perfumers are crafting compositions that celebrate the diversity of olfactory tastes, allowing individuals to choose scents that resonate with their identity rather than conforming to predetermined gendered conventions. Six. Sustainability and conscious sourcing, ethical fragrance practices. As awareness of sustainability grows, contemporary niche perfumery is embracing ethical and environmentally conscious practices. Perfumers are increasingly mindful of sourcing practices, opting for sustainable and responsibly harvested raw materials. Some niche brands go the extra mile, incorporating eco-friendly packaging, and reducing their environmental footprint. Conscious consumers are drawn to niche perfumery brands that prioritize ethical sourcing and sustainable practices. This aligns with a broader movement within the fragrance industry towards transparency and accountability, where consumers seek reassurance that their olfactory indulgence does not come at the expense of environmental or social responsibility. 7. Collaborations and cross-industry influences, niche perfumery is breaking down traditional boundaries by engaging in collaborations and drawing inspiration from diverse industries. Perfumers are partnering with artists, fashion designers, and even chefs to create fragrances that transcend the conventional expectations of the industry. These cross-industry collaborations infuse niche perfumery with fresh perspectives, resulting in fragrances that are not only sensorially intriguing, but also visually and conceptually captivating. The merging of creative disciplines enriches the olfactory landscape, creating a space where fragrance becomes a multi-sensory art form. 8. Digital engagement and community building. In the digital age, niche perfumery has harnessed the power of online platforms to connect with consumers and build communities. Social media, Online forums and virtual events provide a space for fragrance enthusiasts to share their experiences, discuss olfactory preferences, and discover new releases. Niche perfume houses often leverage these digital platforms to engage directly with their audience, sharing behind-the-scenes insights, hosting virtual fragrance tastings, and inviting customers to be part of the creative process. This direct engagement fosters a sense of community and loyalty among fragrance aficionados. 9. The rise of independent perfumers. A personal touch, independent perfumers, often synonymous with niche perfumery, are playing a pivotal role in shaping the contemporary landscape. These individuals, driven by passion and creativity, bring a personal touch to their craft. Their smaller-scale productions allow for greater artistic freedom, enabling them to experiment with unconventional notes 
and explore their unique olfactory visions. Consumers are increasingly drawn to the authenticity and individuality associated with independent perfumers. The stories behind these artisans, their inspirations, and the meticulous craftsmanship involved in each creation resonate with those seeking a more intimate and personal connection to fragrance. Conclusion Niche perfumery as an olfactory frontier. The contemporary landscape of niche perfumery represents an olfactory frontier where individuality, creativity, and personalization converge. This dynamic and evolving sector is characterized by a departure from mass market conventions, a celebration of artistic freedom, and a commitment to offering consumers a more personalized and authentic olfactory experience. From the use of unconventional ingredients, to the rise of independent perfumers, the trends shaping niche perfumery reflect a desire for uniqueness, exploration, and a deeper connection to fragrance. As consumers continue to seek fragrances that resonate with their identities and preferences, the niche perfumery landscape is likely to remain a vibrant and innovative space, continually redefining the boundaries of olfactory artistry.